Jaguars owner Shad Khan making news with an interview he gave in London over the weekend. Khan touched on a variety of issues, including the importance of keeping at least one home game in London each year for revenue and hinted at the need for a new stadium to replace TIAA Bank Field. News 4 Jacks reporter Scott Johnson has been talking with fans and the mayor's office about Khan's interview. Scott? Well, Tom, essentially there are not enough tickets sold here at TIAA Bank Field compared to, like, say, when they go to London. Khan raised some eyebrows when he compared the Jaguars to other teams that are struggling to sell tickets. They're getting new stadiums and they're moving to new cities. The broad interview with Jaguars owner Shad Khan as well as team president Mark Lamping posted on Jaguars.com covers a lot. One is whether more home games are headed to London. Take this quote from Khan, who talks about replacing home games in Jacksonville with what he calls mega experiences like a Green Day or Rolling Stones concert. If we are playing a game away, we want to have one mega experience. Then adds, if we're playing more than one, we would want to have a couple or more. But that's only part of the story. It also talks about the Jags struggling with local revenue and always being near the bottom of the league, like the L.A. Rams, L.A. Chargers, and Oakland Raiders, which are scheduled to move into new stadiums in 2020. I asked the mayor's chief of staff, Brian Hughes, about that. And we have had no formal discussions about it, but obviously, um, if you look across the league, there's there's indicators that uh, that we might be in the next uh, few years or off five, ten years in a in a in a place where that discussion begins. Fans I talked to weren't big on a whole new stadium. A new stadium here? Yeah. It's pretty much a new stadium now, isn't it? You think this, You think so? You don't yeah. think we need it? No, I don't think we need it. Do you think Jacksonville needs a new stadium? No. You don't? Why not? I think the one they got is enough. And news for Jack sports anchor Cole Pepper says the Jaguars note the age of the stadium each year, and he's not sure how fans will feel about losing another home game. Jaguars fans don't want to feel like they're a part-time, they have a part-time team in town here. They just don't. And I want to, want to illustrate, illustrate to you why the London game makes so much. Uh, Profootballreference.com is a website that kind of compiles uh, numbers for how many people show up to games. So far, the first five games, home games of the season, right around 60,000 in attendance at each one, except in London, 84,000. So that ought to indicate why they make so much money in London. But one thing to not overlook, Lot J, what's happening out here. A lot of construction out here once the football season ends. While the stadium may not be replaced, there's going to be a lot of development that could mean good things for the franchise. We're live downtown at TIAA Bank Field. Scott Johnson, Channel 4, The Local Station.